the Federal Audit Service Commission Bill 2017 HB 107 was passed by the House of Representatives on 19 April 2016 and transmitted to the Senate for concurrence. A referral on the bill was sent to the Senate Public Accounts Committee on 13 July 2017 for input and thorough scrutiny to aid the Senate in this passage. The bill is to empower the Office of the Auditor General to bring about proper accountability in public expenditure of the Federation. Presenting the report of the Public Accounts Committee on the floor of the Senate, the Senator representing Edo South Senatorial District and Chairman of the Public Accounts Committee, Senator Matthew Rohide, said the bill which has been passed by the House of Representatives will empower the Office of the Auditor General to bring about accountability in public expenditure of the Federation. On the floor of the Senate, Senator Rohide expressed the importance of the bill which will also establish the Federal Audit Service Commission to care for the staff of the Office of the Auditor General of the Federation as well as repeal the audit account of 1956 public accounts. The committee believes that the bill, if passed, will reposition the Office of Auditor General for the Federation, enhance the capacity of the office to perform its functional role of ensuring transparency, accountability and probity in the management of public funds of the Federation. It will also ensure that Nigeria has an audit act that is more than as it is obtainable with other supreme audit institutions in the world. Senator Matthew Rohide, who noted that the bill has over 50 clauses, enumerated the merits of the bill. The bill passed by the House of Representatives contains 53 clauses. Since the bill was for concurrence, the committee could only affect corrections to what was passed by the House. 25 clauses were retained as passed, while 28 clauses were amended. Most of the amendments were typographical, grammatical, juxtaposition, errors, and etc. The committee wishes to recommend the concurrence of the bill for the Senate. The chairman, on behalf of the members of the committee, wishes to express the committee's appreciation for the confidence reposed in them to serve the Senate. The bill has since been passed into law and waiting the assent of President Muhammad Buhari. Senator Matthew Rohide has, to his credit, a bill for an act to provide for the establishment of National Institute for Hospitality and Tourism, a bill for an act to repeal the Nigeria Tourism Development, a bill to make provision for the licensing, regulation, and supervision of microfinance businesses in Nigeria, a bill on national farm settlement and youth empowerment, a bill on EFCC Act amendment that will ensure proper restructuring and efficiency of the anti graft agency, amongst others and has also moved numerous motions. Best Mbire reporting.